ஒரு இஷ்யூ ாஷ்யகார But let's look at details. So, Prani Naam Sakshad, so Prani Naam Sakshad, Abhyudaya Nishreyasa Hetuhu, Yaha Saha Dharma, so Saha Dharma Ha, Brahmana Dharma, दीर्घेण कालिन अनुष्ठातृण कामोद्भवान विवेक विज्ञान हेतुक अधर्मेण अभिभूय धर्मे प्रवर्धम चर्मे जगत स्थिति पिपाल सह आदिकर्ता नारायणाख्य विष्णु भौम से ब्रह्मण ब्राह्मण से रक्षणाथ देवक्याम वसुदेवाद अंशेन कृष्ण किल संबूव ब्राह्मण रक्षण रक्षित सैदिक धर्म तदीन वर्णाश्रम भेदान सृष्टि बहुवचन साक्षाति व्यय सो प्राणी नाम प्राणी नाम साक्षात फॉर दि बीइंग्स साक्षात डायरेक्टली अभ्युदय निश्रेयस हेतु अभ्युदय विदिन दि समास अभ्युदय निश्रेयस हेतु थ्री वर्ड्स सो हेतु हेतु इज कॉज Cause for what? Nishreyasa, Abhyudaya and Nishreyasa. So Abhyudaya and Nishreyasa would be Dvandva, Itaritana Dvandva and Nishreyasa, Hetu. Hetu for Abhyudaya and Nishreyasa, so Shashti Tathpurusha. Cause for, so we say worldly and spiritual goals, we'll just say it this way. basically what uh, worldly benefits and liberation so you can say say worldly benefits uh, or say worldly benefits worldly benefits and liberation let's say yaha dharma that which saha that dharma प्रथम एक वचन धर्म ब्राह्मण वर्णिभि आश्रम विश्च सो ऑल इज आर इन सामनाकरण एंड सो ऑल थ्री ऑल थ्री यू कैन ट्रांसलेट टूगेदर ऑल दीज आर ब्राह्मण वर्णिभि आश्रम विश्च विच all this will go as a uh, as a single phrase so by by those belonging to so brahmanas 
ब्राह्मण एटसेट्रा तो ब्राह्मण एटसेट्रा एटसेट्रा और यू कैन से बाय बाय दोज ओके आई जस्ट लीव इट दिस वे यू गेट द आइडिया सो बाय ब्राह्मण एट एटसेट्रा एंड एंड दोज बिलोंग टू वेरियस स्टेजेस स्टेजेस ऑफ लाइफ दोज दोज बिलोंगिंग टू वेरियस वर्णस एंड स्टेजेस ऑफ लाइफ सॉ श्रेयवर्ती भी श्रेयवर्ती भी एंड दीज आर हू आर दोस्त दे आर श्रेय श्रेयर्थी श्रेयवर्थी दिस इज तद्दिता दोस्त डिजायरस ऑफ लिबरेशन बाय दोस्त सो बाय दोस्त तृतीय अनुष्ठेयमान प्रैक्टिस्ड सो दिस इज वॉट प्रैक्टिस्ड practiced will go with dharma that dharma that dharma which is practiced practiced by whom practiced by all of these brahmanadi varnivi ashram vishcha shreyorti bhi dirghena kalena dirghena kalena so is it due to uh, or you can even translate as Uh, in a long time uh, to make it fit in the english phrase or say due to passage of a long time anusthatruna for the practitioners kamo udbhavat again hetau panchami so I, i prefer to write as by which hetau panchami due to Uh, due to rise of desire hiya mana viveka vijnana hiya mana shana janta viveka vijnana hetuka hetuka is one word hetukena so the samasa will be what hiya mana viveka vijnana hetukena adharmena will go with adharma so that due to adharma again this is also hetu hetu tritiya due to so you can put together and see this is hetuka kapratya is telling you that it is this entire samasa is likely bahurihi and since it is in samana dekaro with adharmena therefore this stands for adharma so adharma which is hetu adharma which is hetu for <coughs> adharma which is the cause so hetukena that uh, hiya mana viveka vijnana hetukena that for which adharma which is hetu or that adharma for which there is hetu and what is the hetu hetu in the form of vijnana and viveka so if adharma is the hetu then this will not be a bahuri hiya mana viveka vijnana hetuka adharma it would be but adharma is not Uh, that where viveka and vijnana is lacking ajna uh, adharma is that which has a cause because adharma is not having less viveka and having less vijnana does not mean less having uh, adharma uh, it, that itself does not mean adharma adharma is some papa karma which is done due to lack of vijnana and viveka therefore this hiya mana hiya mana is due to Uh, reduction of due to decrease in decrease in viveka and vijnana so uh, that becomes the cause for adharma therefore adharma and hetuka this this word ending in hetuka although it is in samana adikaranam it is adharma itself is not the hetu adharma has hetu therefore this is bahuri first it is bahuri anya pada is adharma so what kind of bahuri now hetuka so hetuka you 
Hiyamana, Viveka, Vijnana. All these are Hiyamana is Viveka. Viveka has reduced and Vijnana has reduced. Vijnana is Viveka and Vijnana is Dvandva. But in Bahuri, see I have seen lot of, uh, not lot of, lot of people struggle with Bahuri. But Bahuri, if you know it is Bahuri, then you don't need to resolve all these Samasas. You don't need to think what is Hiyamana, what is Viveka, Vijna, between Hiyamana and Viveka, Viveka and Vijnana. You don't need to think about that. You can directly make a single Vakya, which is easier. Uh, earlier we saw um, uh, in the uh, uh, earlier uh, sentences, last Patha we saw Jnana, uh, there was a Jnana Vairagya, Jnana Vairagya Lakshana. So Jnana Vairagya Lakshanam, so here Jnana Vairagya Lakshanam, I have said earlier also we have seen before this sentence also there was another sentence which said uh, Pravritti Lakshanam. So Pravritti Lakshanam and then uh, Pravritti Lakshanam this I had told you that it is Bahuri and similarly this is also Bahuri, Jnana Vairagi Lakshanam. How do you make a Vigraha Vakya now? Either you solve this Lakshanam being Bahuri, Jnana and Vairagya what is, I had mentioned that this is Dvandva. Either you make a dvandva, stop there and then with this dvandva make another uh, with lakshana. So th these two, jnana and vairagya you will have dvandva. So you will have to make two vigra vakyas. Jnana vairagya you have to make one vigra vakya which is dvandva vigra vakya. And jnana vairagya as the purva pada you have to make with lakshana as the uh, an, uh, uttara pada. You have to make another samasa bahuri. Instead of that, Aneka Manya Padarte. So, if you say Dvandva and then Bahuri, here you will have to say what? Dvandva is Jnanam, Jnanam is neuter, Jnanam, Vairagyam. So, Jnanam and Vairagyam are two Pada. So, Jnanam Cha, Vairagyam Cha, Jnana, like Vairagya is Akaranta, like Phala. Phalam phale phalani. So, jnana vairagye. Vairagye would be your dvandva. So, jnanam cha vairagye cha jnana vairagye. Phalam phale like that. And then jnana vairagye. Bahuri when you make, you will have to say jnana vairagye. Lakshane Yasya Saha Yasya Dharma Sya Saha Dharma and then Tam in second case it will become Tam. So Tam. This is how your Vigravakya. Otherwise, what do you do? Or directly you can say Jnanam Cha Vairagyan Cha. Jnanam cha vairagyan cha lakshana, lakshane, lakshane yasya saha. So this is easier. Jnanam cha vairagyan cha lakshane yasya. You can make in one single bahuri vakya, vigra vakya. Because aneka manya padarte, in dvandva and in bahuri, you can have many padas in a uh, single vigra vakya. Now if we have to resolve this hiyamana viveka vijnana, either you resolve Hiyamana and Viveka, then Viveka Vijnana, what you keep on inquiring and Vijnana Hetuka, what is the connection? If you, and in uh, uh, Samasa I have said earlier that you have to start from the right side, the last Pada and then see Hetuka, is Vijnana Hetuka, what is the connection between Vijnana and Hetuka, Viveka and Vijnana, when you see Viveka and Vijnana, Viveka and Vijnana are two separate things grouped together, therefore there is a Dvandva here, so if I have to make separate Vigraha Vakyas, last one although I know it is Bahuri, then I will say this is Dvandva. What kind of Dvandva? It will be an Itaretara Dvandva. Itaretara Dvandva. Earlier also what we did here, what we did in um, sorry, Jnana Vairagya. So here this is what? This is also Itaretara Dvandva. Now, if I have to solve this Hiyamana Viveka Vijnana Hetukena, between Viveka and Vijnana, it is Itaretara Dvandva. 
and viveka vijnana becomes one samasa which connects with hiyamana because hiyamana means those which are declining and declined shanajanta that which has declined what has declined viveka has declined and vijnana has also de declined therefore viveka vijnana as dual and hiyamana as dual i'll have to take in and make a vigraha vakya and th so what is that this is between this and these viveka vijnana when you make together so first you resolve viveka and vijnana vivek viveka cha vijnanan cha viveka vijnane together they will become neuter because last pada is neuter dwandva it will become viveka vijnana and then hiya mana hiya mana also in neuter how will it decline hiya mane dual hiya mane viveka vijnane that will be karma dharaya so first you have to do itaretar dwandva then karma dharaya but itaretar dwandva you have resolved first and in brackets and then earlier one with earlier one you have karma dharaya or better still what do you do so that's why i said 1 1 1 bhauri so one this is in single one this is in pratha prathama this is in prathama this is in prathama because all of these put together if you say hiyamana viveka and vijnana viveka is hiyamana vijnana is uh, hiyamana so you can say all all these put together are in samanadi karanyam they are talking about the same thing viveka and vijnana which has declined therefore this entire thing is like a karma dharya and in bahuri mostly you will see that kind of a thing only and that is the hetu so therefore this entire thing will be in samana adikaranam with the last pada and that last pada is in bahuri with adharma so either you do this karma dhar and uh, itaretar dwandva or better still directly do bahuri so either you have to do this and then say bahuri or 1 1 1 so one this is one this is one this is one what is the connection of hetu ka with adharma adharma has hetu adharma has hetu which what is that hetu adharma has the hetu which is decline declining viveka and vijnana viveka and vijnana have declined for and that has the connection here so generally you can take shashti so 1116 bahuri dharma for which the hetu is the declined viveka and vijnana so due to adharma so we have said adharma not dharma adharma due to adharma which has that is the shashti has hetu reason or cause reason what is the reason which has the reason in the form of or which has uh, which has declined discrimination and knowledge vijnana as the cause cause or reason see it is a cause hetu and due to this what happens so this is sati saptami sati saptami i prefer i is usually a short form i write ss sati saptami i had mentioned last time also samana adikaranam this so when when dharma when dharma abhibhuyamana dharma has declined when when dharma has declined abhibhuyamana is also shana janta when declined so when this will be what this if you when you say when dharma has declined how do i get this has so this question will come has there is no shashti so individually when i translate this when declined and when dharma how do i put this together now when declined when dharma so when dharma dharma is that which has declined so when dharma is that which has declined thereby dharma and declined are in samana adikaran both are in saptami sati saptami sati saptami is you tra translate as when when the dharma has declined therefore when declined and when dharma it will not make sense because if you translate individually 
So you translate this individually, but you know that these are in Samana Dikran and when you translate them together, you will get what? When Dharma has declined. So when Dharma has declined, what is the reason? So you read back. When Dharma has declined due to Adharma, which itself has declined, uh, discrimination and knowledge as the cause. And what is that due to? This lack of discrimination and knowledge is due to what? Due to rise of desire. Rise of desire overshadows buddhi and thereby there is lack of discrimination and knowledge or you can translate it together and say discriminative knowledge. Either way, way you take it is okay. And that rise of desire, what does it do? Is for whom? For the practices of dharma. For the practices dharma. Which practices of what? Which has been said. This dharma which is being practiced. And why has... Uh, or over a period of time, this due to passage of time or you can say over a period of time, better still over a period of time, over a period of long time, over a period of long time what has happened, uh, for the practices this due to rise of desire across eras, desire has kept on increasing and they have accumulated whether in the same life or across various lives and thereby there is uh, lack of Vijnana and Viveka and then Adharma has, the end result is what? There is Adharma which has rise, which has risen and uh, Dharma has declined. So Dharma has declined and therefore Pravardham Anecha Adharme. This is also Sati Saptami. What is the result of when Dharma has declined, what will happen? Adharma will grow. Therefore Pravardham Anecha Adharme and when and when adharma has grown so this is a increased and pravardhamane so i am translating it together jagata sthitim paripalayeshu pari pipalayeshu sah adikarta narayan akhya vishnu so vishnu who is what narayana Narayana Akhya. Narayana and Akhya. Akhya means name. Narayana and name. What is Narayana and name? This is not, uh, name is not being indicated here. What is being talked about? A person who has a name Narayana. Therefore, this is also Bahuri, Anyapada Pradhana. So, Narayana, Narayana Akhya Yasya. Vishnoho Saha. So this is what? 116 Bhauri. He who has the name Narayana. Or you say he who called Narayana. Vishnu who is also called Narayana. Who is Adi Karta. Adi Karta, Karta, Adi Karta, he is the first creator, Karta, Karta, first doer of something, of what? Of creation, there is no one who precedes him, therefore he is the first and he is the Karta, what kind of Samasa would it be, if he is the first and he is the Karta, what kind of a Samasa? If it is Dvandva, then there are two people, Amma. So, there, there is Paramatma who is Karta and is there another first? No. Then what kind of Samasa? Not Dvandva. What kind of a Samasa when the Puropada and uh, Uttarapada are in Samanadi Karanyam? They talk about the same, same entity. Anyone? Karma dharaya. So you get karma dharaya. This is karma dharaya. Adishcha. Adishcha asau karta cha. Same person. Saha adi karta. That 
that first creator so first creator does not really make sense we'll say creator creator who was the first was the first or was always there sah and who is he he is paripalayeshu we have seen this like mumukshu what kind of a dhatu would this be this is a derived dhatu what kind of a dhatu derived dhatus are called what derived dhatu samma krudanta is not a dhatu what are derived dhatus called krudanta is a padam dhatu with a krut pratyay is called krudanta i am asking what is a dhatu word is krudanta all right sananta sananta dhatu and sananta dhatu plus so you have san here you have san plus already krudanta where you get u pratyay like mumukshu last time we talked about it when it takes a san pratyay that time it takes u to make a karta now what is the dhatu here dhatu is sananta dhatu so i'll just say dash here so that it's not plus it is a dhatu which is ending with san so dhatu will be what pal you see pal ishu palai pali and then pal ishu so uh, how do you say this uh, so pali tum pari pari pali tum ichu so pari pali tum ichu will become what pari pipal ishu you see dvitvam here this has become pipala pal has become pipala and pari is the upasarga pari is completely paritaha paritaha pipal ishu pipal ishu one who is wanting to protect it completely so therefore this is sananta dhatu and pari purvaka परिपूर्वक पाल प्लस सन एंड देन ऊ सो वन हू इज डिजायरस ऑफ सॉरी टू मेनी टाइपोस ऑफ प्रोटेक्टिंग कंप्लीटली प्रोटेक्टिंग कंप्लीटली प्रोटेक्टिंग व्हाट देयर फॉर कर्मा इज एक्सपेक्टेड here the karma goes in second case so stitim sustenance sustenance of what shashti sustenance of the world so one this adi karta narayan apte vishnu who is interested in desirous of completely protecting uh, protecting the sustenance of the world so you can say protecting the world also in the uh, final translation what did he do so further it is said bhaumasya shashti ek vachana brahmana shashti ek vachana brahmanatvasya rakshanartham rakshanartham sarakshanartham chaturthi artha rakshanartham one it can be one or two we'll see whether it is prathama or dvitiya देवक्या सप्तमी एक वचन वासुदेवाद अंशेन तृतीया कृष्ण किल संभूव संभूव इज लिटलकारा लिटलकारा ऑफ व्हाट सम प्लस हू प्लस लिट was born so was born who was born vishnu was born and who was uh, indeed he, he was born kila indeed born krishna was born i will not translate amshena as a can say as a part or 
part is actually as a as a child as a son so as a part meaning as a child of devaki so from born born from born from vasudeva and he was born in in devaki so i'm doing literal translation so as a as a part of vasudeva he was born in devaki and therefore there is no second case needed here this is first case rakshanartham and why was he born this is the hetu for so hetu tadarte tadarte chaturthi not not a hetu tadarte for that purpose so the purpose uh, takes chaturthi rakshanartham for protection so for the pr- purpose of protection or you say for protection same meaning for the purpose of protection protection of what therefore shashti of brahmanatvam of brahmanatvam so brahmanatvam i'll just leave it like that brahmanatvam brahmanatvam bhaumasya and not only brahmana so i'll say uh, so this is brahmanatva se means complete varna vyavastha and this is of vedas brahmana of vedas of vedas and followers of vedas of vedas this is not plural but brahmanatvasya okay i'll leave it like this brahmanatva itself otherwise you have to say for status of status of brahmana so you say status of a brahm let's say okay let's keep it literal for now for the status of brahmana bhomasya bhomasya is of the entire and this is in samana dikrunit brahmana of the entire vedas so what does this mean krishna was indeed born as a child from vasudeva in devaki for the purpose of protection of uh, protection of the entire vedas and uh, so not not for this is of protection for the purpose of protection of i wrote for of of the status of brahmana also and entire vedas okay sah vishnu narayanakya was born as krishna so this is what this is the subject vishnu is the subject he was born and krishna is the is the subjective complement so subject and subjective complement and why why only of the protection of brahmana brahmanatva only no here it is said why because he because because brahmanatvasya of the status of brahmana means those are following brahmana status of so of status of brahmana rakshane rakshane sati saptami why because because when brahmanatva se rakshane when uh, when there is protection protection of whom protection of brahmanatvam then what happens rakshita tanta rakshita protected bhuta kale protected would be vidhiling would be protected what would be protected vaidika dharma vaidika dharma will not translate vaidika dharma will protect will so vaidika why why was he born to protect vedas and the followers of vedas because brahmanatvasya rakshane hi only when brahmanatvam is because brahmana is the one who predominantly follows vedas others follow parts of vedas but brahmana follows the vedas and supposed to follow the vedas and protect that also therefore when brahmana is protected dharma will remain protected will be protected vaidika dharma would be protected why and again it is explained hetu panchami due to due to tad tad adhinatvat tad adhinatvat varnashram bhedanam of all the bheda all the 
divisions of varnashrama so classification so of classification of the varna and ashrama of varna and stages of life so what is this what kind of a samasa would this be now classification bheda naam of so it is be talking talking about bheda only not of anything which has classification bheda naam tadani adhijanatvat because the classification of the varna and stages of life depends on so due to adhina adhina is dependent due to dependence dependence on that so this this is also samasa and this is also samasa varnashrama varna ashrama and bheda bheda means classification or divisions divisions of what so when you say division there is a there is an akanksha of therefore this is shashti tatpurusha talking about divisions therefore tatpurusha uttara pada pradhana shashti tatpurusha and division of of what varna and ashrama when you say varna and ashrama it will become itare tar dvandva so itare tar dvandva and shashti tatpurusha what is this tad adhinatvat due to dependence dependence when how do you ask dependence when you say dependence dependence on what therefore saptami tatpurusha dependence on tad adhinatvat tad is the tasmin tasmin adhinatvat tas tad and adhina have a saptami sambandha therefore tasmin adhina uh, and then tasya bhava tasmin adhina tad adhina and tasya bhava tad adhina tvam tasmat tad adhina tvat <coughs> so we'll say tasmin adhina <coughs> sorry adhina and it will take the linga of what tasmin adhina tvat varnashrama bheda naam this bheda varnashrama bhedas are tasmin adhina therefore bheda bheda adhina adhina bheda would be uh, bheda would be uh, pullinga so tasmin adhina tad adhina tad adhina and then tasya bhavah फास्टर नाउ एज यू नो क्वेश्चन हियर So if I have to make an anvaya here, not much to do anvaya, but if you have to do, just read it. Yaha, yaha, writing it is a little difficult. I write it above and then copy it. Yaha, so yaha is there. Yaha will go in the beginning and yaha saha. So yaha and saha you have to yaha dharma ha saha dharma saha dharma ha and what is being said here what is talked about here this dharma yaha dharma ha <coughs> prani naam prani naam sakshat अभ्यु दय निश्रेयस सॉरी स हेतु दैट धर्म विच इज यह धर्म प्राणी नाम साक्षात अभ्यु निश्रेयस हेतु सह धर्म दैट धर्म इट्स सह धर्म ब्राह्मण स्वर्णी आश्रम एंड हू आर दो श्रेयोर्ति श्रेयोर्ति 
श्रेयोर्ति भी ब्राह्मणाद्य ही वर्णि भी आश्रम अनुष्ठीयम सह से सह श्रेयोर्ति भी ब्राह्मणाद्य ही वर्णि भी आश्रम अनुष्ठीयम धर्म दैट धर्म प्रैक्टिस बाय ऑल ऑफ दीज All of these are in this is same group of people who are interested in moksha, and that dharma which gives you worldly as well as spiritual benefits. What about them? Then sah dharma ha. What happened? That sah dharma ha here. Further, it will be what? Kamod bhavat hiya mana he tu kena adhar mena. So then further you can connect to this this part anushtya mana. तेन दीर्घेण कालेन अनुष्ठातृण कामोद्भवाम विवेक विज्ञान हेतु के अधर्मेण अभिभूयम धर्मे प्रवर्धम चधर्मे सो यू दिस फर्दर ऑल ऑफ दिस विल रिमेन सेम दैट धर्म वेन डिक्लाइन्स वेन इट डिक्लाइन्स वेन धर्म डिक्लाइन्स वॉट हैपन्स एंड अधर्म गोज अप ड्यू टू दीज रीजन दैट टाइम वॉट हैपन्स विष्णु नारायणाख्य विष्णु आदि कर्ता परिपिपालेशु जगत स्थिति परिपिपालेशु सो ऑल दिस कैन रिमेन इन दी सेम वे जगत जगत स्थिति परिपिपालेशु सह आदि कर्ता नारायणाख्य विष्णु भौम से ब्रह्मण ब्राह्मण रक्षण देवक्या वसुदेवा अंशेन कृष्ण किल संभवू सो ऑल दिस कैन रिमेन सेम This only this initial part need need to make an anvaya of, and then rest. Rest you can keep in the same manner. Okay, due to the font issue, let's look here. What does it say further? So Bhasya Kara further says, "Sacha Bhagwan, Yane Shwara Shakti Bala Viriya Tejo Vihi Sada Sampanna Trigunaatmi Kam Swam Maya Mula Prakriti Mashi Kritya." अज अव्यय भूताईश्वर निशुद्धबुद्ध मुक्त स्वभाव अभी सन् स्वया देहवान्व जाता इव च लोकानुग्रह लोकानुग्रह कुरन लक्ष्य स्वप्रयोजना भूतानुजिघृक्षया वैदिक धर्म दर्जुनाय शोकमोह महादो निमग्नाय उपदेश उपदेश इज दि वर्ब लिटलकार धर्म प्रचय गमिष्यति इति तम धर्म भगवता यथा उपदिष्ट यथोपदिष्ट सामसा यथोपदिष्ट अव्यय भाव यथोपदिष्ट वेद व्यास सर्वज्ञो भगवान् गीताक्षि सप्त श्लोकशत उपनिबंध उपनिबंध सो उपनिबंध इज ऑलो वर्ब सो सच भगवान आई नॉट ऐड एनीथिंग फर्दर सच भगवान ज्ञानेश्वर शक्ति बलवीर तेजो भी सदा संपन्न मयाम स्वाम मयाम वॉट केस वुड इट बी स्वाम मयाम माया सेकेंड केस सो मयाम एंड दिस इज ऑल्सो स्वाम मयाम दिस सेकेंड केस त्रिगुणात्मक स्वाम मयाम मूल प्रकृति दट इज दैट इट सेल्फ इज मूल प्रकृति इट इज कर्मा टू लबंत वशीकृत्य वशीकृत्य इज लबंत रिप्लेसमेंट फॉर त्वा लब अज अज सॉरी अज अव्यय भूताईश्वर निशुद्ध निशुद्ध बुद्ध मुक्त स्वभाव अभी सन् सोमया देहवान्व एज दो हैविंग देह Really, he does not have deha. As though having deha, 
देहवान इव जात सो देहवान इज वॉट मतुपंथ जात इव च एज दो बॉन नॉट रियली बॉन एज दो बॉन लोकानुग्रह कुर्व लक्ष्य सो एपियर्स लक्ष्य वी कैन से एपियर्स एपियर्स एज दो डूइंग डूइंग वॉट एज दो डूइंग लोकानुग्रह सो सो और नॉट एज दो एज दो एज दो बॉन एंड एज दो हैविंग अ बॉडी ही एपियर्स एज दो हैविंग अ बॉन having been born and having a body he appears though as though having all this and what he is for what what purpose that is it lokanugraham kurvan lakshate doing the welfare of the world so such a bhagwan nothing to translate there jnana ishwara shakti bala virya tejo vihi सदा संपन्न सो संपन्न इज तांत सो हि देर सी ज्ञान ज्ञान ऐश्वर्य शक्ति बल वीर तेज सो दिस इज अ द्वंद्व यू डोंट नीड टू डू मच हियर हियर ऑल्सो आई जस्ट शोड यू सेपरेशन हियर ऑल्सो यू कैन डू विद इन दि समास देर इज नो नीड टू डू पदच्छेद Here I just mentioned there are four words. Generally, you read what Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Swabhava. I just added here. I'll have to make a sandhi also. I have to so Jnana and Aishwarya. So here, if you have to say Jnana and Aishwarya, when you read, you read Jnana and Aishwarya. That is not how it should be read. So if you have to split it, Jnana, Aishwarya, Shakti, Bala, Virya, then Tej, Tejo. How will you separate it? Is Tejas, Tejas, and Tejas in Tritya. बहुवचन दिस इज वॉट इतरे तर द्वंद्व ऑल पुट टुगेदर इतरे तर द्वंद्व लाइक दिस नित्य शुद्ध बुद्ध मुक्त स्वभाव इज ऑल्सो इट बी वॉट हियर इफ यू मेक द्वंद्व हियर इफ यू मेक द्वंद्व नित्य शुद्ध बुद्ध मुक्त स्वभाव हियर इट इज नॉट द्वंद्व विल सी दिस विल कम एंड सी वेन वी रीच हियर सो संपन्न संपन्न कैन एनी वन गेस वॉट कैंड ऑफ प्रत्यय इज देर हियर A little tricky, so think over. Sampanna. Can you see the dhatu here? Can you see the dhatu? संपूर्वक वॉट सम प्लस वॉट पद इट इज पद पद प्लस त बिकम्स संपन्न संपन्न एंडोर्ड विथ सॉरी एंडोर्ड विथ एंडोर्ड सो एंडोर्ड संपन्न मीन्स तांता एंड भूते सो एंडोर्ड एंडोर्ड विथ वॉट Always endowed with, always endowed with goes with thirty. So there with is with all these, with nyana, aishwarya, shakti, bala, virya, teja. That I will not translate. What happens that Bhagwan Sah Bhagwan Vashi Krutya? What does he do? Having having brought under influence. Having brought what under influence, Vashi Krutya, Mula Prakruti, which is Maya. So Swam Maya, and it is his own. This is Tadita Swam, his own, own Maya, which is also called as Mula Prakruti, and Trigunatmika. Trigunatmika is that Maya is Trigunatmika. So Maya Atma here is uh, means Swabhava here. Trigunatmika is called. त्रिगुण स्वभाव सो स्वभाव और आत्मा हियर आत्मा इन स्त्रीलिंग इट विल बिकम आत्मिका व्हेन डिस्कर्श टेल्स यू डिस्कर्श टेल्स यू इट इज बहुरी सो इट इज बहुरी एंड व्हाट इज द बहुरी त्रिगुणात्मिका त्रिगुणात्मिका इज दैट विच हैज थ्री गुणास दैट माया विच इज मेड ऑफ थ्री गुणास और दैट विच हैज थ्री गुणास ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज मूल प्रकृति 
Vashikurti having brought it under his influence and who is this Sada, uh, Sada Sampannaha? Ajaha, he is Ajaha, really unborn. Unborn and he is also Avyaya, indeclinable. So Avyaya is what? Avyaya is also Samasa. What kind of Samasa would this be? Ajaha is also Samasa. Tatpurusha. Not born. So, one who is not born, Tatpurusha. What Tatpurusha? Uh, jaha, Jayate Ti Jaha, and then Na Jaha Ajaha. Nanj Tatpurusha. So, it is Nanj Tatpurusha. This is also what? Vyeti iti vyayaha, na, na vyayaha avyaya, so na vyeti, nanjitat purusha, indeclinable. Bhutana Mishara, overlord of, of beings, who is what? Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Sabhava, he is not Sabhava, if he is not Sabhava then what kind of a uh, compound is it? Ishwara is not Sabhava. Is Ishwara nature? Ish, nature as in is. Do you say a person is good nature? No, you say he, he has good nature. So, what kind of? Yes, Bahuri. So, this is how you analyze Bahuri. So, Sabhava is ending with Sabhava is Bahuri. Ishwara, who is Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Sabhava. Although we say he is Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Sabhava. We don't say he is Sabhava. When you say is he Sabhava, no. He has Sabhava. But when you put together the words in the compound, Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Sabhava, there you don't say he has Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Sabhava. We say he is Nitya Shuddha Buddha Mukta Sabhava, meaning he has Sabhava of being Nitya Shuddha Buddha and Mukta. So he has, nit has Nitya Sabhava, he has Shuddha Sabhava, he has Buddha Sabhava and he has Mukta Sabhava. Therefore, Bahuri of this is all this put together, you will say this is Gandva, but the ending is Bahuri. So, Nitya, Nityam, Shuddham, uh, Buddha, Mukta, Sabhava, Yasya, Saha, Ishara. Apisan, even, even though he is, even though, even though he is one who has, one who has nature of what? This whatever, Nitya. Nitya is what? Always being there. So, he is ever existent. Nature of being ever existent. Ever, ever existent nature. So, this again, this Nitya, Shuddha, Buddha, Mukta, all this, I think I had mentioned this earlier, all this four can be taken as separate. Nitya and Shuddha and Buddha and Mukta or you can say Nitya Shuddha, Nitya Buddha and Nitya Mukta. So, Shuddha, always pure, so thereby Nitya Shuddha will mean always pure, Nitya Buddha is always um, conscious, so ever conscious, ever sentient and ever free, ever mukta or you say who is always existent, ever existent, ever existent means he is infinite, he is ever existent, he is ever pure, uh, he is ever, so ever existent, Nitya will mean ever existent, then you do not take Nitya with Shuddha, another way, so he is pure, he is uh, uh, sentient as in consciousness and he is free. That Ishwara of whose Ishwara? Of all beings. Therefore, of beings. Ishwara of being overlord of or you can say lord itself. He overlords, therefore overlord. Ishwara. Varach Pratya. This is a Varach Pratya Anta Shabda. Varach Pratya gives you um, gives you a um, uh, tachilya, it is a tachilya pratya. So, it is his very nature to lord over. That is why he is called Ishwara. Isha, he is Isha and Varach pratya tells you Isha always, always so, that is his very nature. And even being, so even though, 
even being even though being one who has nature of being ever free and ever uh, so all this nitya shuddha buddha even of that nature what happens swamayaya dehavan eva so swamayaya tritiya or swamaya swamaya is his own maya swasya maya swamaya shashti tatpurusha swamaya dehavani dehavan is what deha asya sthiti dehavan one who has deha matu panta world embodied embodied eva as do embodied as do embodied jata ha jata is born as do born as do born and as do born so although he is never born he is ajaha avyaya so he can he is unborn even being ishwara of all beings unborn and indeclinable and one who has nature of being nitya shuddha buddha mukta still what somaya with the help of with the help of his own maya so his maya appears as though as though born and as though embodied and dehavan eva lakshyate so appears as though i'll say appears as though born as though for what purpose kurvan doing so doing what second case will become karma loka anugraham welfare of the world lokas loka naam anugraha anugraham welfare of the world or people however you take it srishti tat purusha kurvan lakshyate appears okay i'll stop here last time we went uh, quite a lot further so we are going a little slow uh, if you feel you are comfortable with uh, uh, the way we are going i can increase the speed then we can see this any questions Okay. Okay. Then I'll stop here. Uh, maybe we we have gone a little slow here because I repeated the entire thing that we did uh, a little fast towards the end last time. A longer sentence. This we'll see, and then we'll uh, try to increase the speed of the field. Yes, Anand, ask the questions. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think this is more like a question on the meaning of that uh, first shloka. Uh, 